incredibly scary. Mm -hmm. All right, when you visit Google.com, you usually see the familiar red, blue, yellow, and green letters, and sometimes the word features art commemorating a special holiday or event. Yes, but by this time next week, the design you see could be that of the work of a 13-year-old from Gretna. Lily Cummings introduces us to the talented young woman who is in the top five of the Doodle for Google competition. Annalise Perez is now a nationally recognized artist. I've been doing art for a while. Like my dad is really focused on art, so I kind of got that from him. Perez submitted this design in the Doodle for Google competition. The theme was I'm grateful for. Her artwork is a self-portrait sitting in her room. I was thinking about a lot of stuff. I was like, out of all those things, I think the thing I'm most grateful for is just like, like the quiet, serene moments. After winning the best design from Louisiana, the public weighed in. I felt like a politician. I was asking for votes from everyone. Perez <laughs> racked up the votes and placed top five nationally. And they didn't say what they called about. They was just like, this is so-and-so from Google. We have news, and I was like. <laughs> All the time she spends drawing on her tablet is paying off. Literally, she was awarded a $5,000 scholarship. If she wins first place, she'll walk away with a $50,000 tech package for her school, Young Audiences Charter School in Gretna, and a $30,000 college scholarship, which is good news for mom. I am glad that she's being recognized for her talents. She's very humble with it. In fact, when we asked Perez what's next for her and her art, we learned she's a young woman of many talents. I do still want to pursue art, but it might not be my main focus going forward. She says theater may be her top priority as she starts high school. Regardless, at age 13, Perez is already in the spotlight. <laughs> Lily Cummings, Eyewitness News. Well, the national winner is announced on June 6th. Then their art is displayed on Google.com for 24 hours. By the way, Perez will also be live on the Eyewitness Morning News tomorrow. Catch her in the 8 o'clock hour of the show on WUPL. Congratulations to her already. Yeah, that is a huge feat. Awesome, and it's beautiful art. Yes. No matter what happens, she should be proud of herself. Yes, that's, yeah. that's incredible. I love these stories of young people doing awesome things. And we have a awesome lot of them city. here doing great things. We do, things. very much so.